Hello. Yo. What is going on? Today is a fucking shit day, okay? Um, I've lost two trades this week so far, unfortunately, but that is okay. Um, I'm going to go over them and why they're shit, okay? Let's start with the very first one that I took, which was Tuesday, uh, the 16th. Um, we had a breaker structure here, breaker structure here, and price just kept going lower and lower and lower and lower. Okay. Um, and then let's see, where are we? So once I had that breaker structure on the five minute, I went down to the one minute <clears throat> and I had seen this fair value gap, um, here. Price came back in. Now, this is where I fucked up. Okay? I entered because it hit my fucking fair value gap when normally I wait for a, a break of structure back out is usually when I typically re or enter. Um, and it entered my fair value gap. And I was like, fuck, dude. Let me get in on this big fucking trade up to this upside. Well, I'm a stupid fuck. And I didn't listen to my own rules, and I answered here. And within fucking 10 minutes, it just kept going down, and I lost. Because I had my stop lost. My stop loss placed at these lows over here to the beginning of the spare value gap here. Okay? Well, if we would have just fucking been patient, and I still maybe could have entered. Okay? It came down to this spare value gap here. Broke structure here. And it did keep coming down um, in hindsight, you know, if I would have placed my trade off of this very value gap here, break a structure here. If I would have placed my trade right here and then let's see this very value gap. It would I have been smart to fucking place my range uh, down here to these lows, right? And then, wow, would you look at that? Nothing but a fucking rip to the upside. Okay, so my dumbass was impatient. Okay, and doing so, it caused me to fucking lose. Being impatient. I want to keep it the same way I had it. So yeah, so I answered here, didn't wait. If I was just patient and had a larger stop loss um we would have we would have seen nothing but fucking massive return okay so my analysis of the market going up was correct i was just being an impatient stupid fuck and i made a mistake rip anyways then it trade wednesday then trade monday we'll see what tomorrow brings um this was today. Let's go to the five minute. This was today. Um, came down. Now, there wasn't a break of structure, okay? I traded a little bit differently today. And guess what? I fucking lost because I didn't listen to my rules, okay? But my trade entry for today was I had seen there's a fair value up here to here, this range. And it was respected the first time and gave our gave us a fucking massive rip. Okay. Well, price came back down into this range very nicely. And it started to come back up. And I was like, fuck, dude. Like, price is coming into this fair value gap, man. Like, this shit, this shit could be meant. Okay. So, I placed my stop loss at the bottom of this other fair value gap. Okay. Go down to the one minute. I seen that it came into the fair value gap. It came out. Breaking structure right here. I entered here. Okay. And then it fucking teased me for like 20 minutes. And then it fucking went to the upside. Oops. This line right here. Man, fuck. That line right there was my 0.75. Uh, just barely, okay? That line was just barely my 0 
where I should have closed out 75% of my trade, but I was on fucking lunch. So I missed out. In turn, lost. Um, so yeah, losses happen, man, but damn, does it fucking suck. I don't care what anybody says. Oh, you shouldn't have emotions in trading. Shut the fuck up, okay? I don't like losing. But yeah, two L's for the week compared to the fucking seven that I had, like, the last two weeks, man. We'll see what tomorrow brings. I just gotta stay strict to the strat, okay? Stay strict to the strat and see what happens. But yeah, other than that, pretty sure I have fucking strep, but we don't give a fuck. I hope you guys have a wonderful day, and I will talk to you guys tomorrow if I take a trade. If not, sometime next week. Have a good day. Peace.